Hey, what's up guys? Lou here for Who Canadian. How y'all doing? I haven't done a video in a while. Well, you know what? In about a week now. And if you follow me on Instagram, you know that I I work for Can the Canadian Post and we're very busy. I got a new route. It's a pain in the... So, um, tonight we're reviewing hookah fruit uh, grape flavor. I've already been smoking it for about maybe 30 40 minutes. And as you saw in my bowl, I have a lot in it <laughs> more than I need. But I wanted to be able to smoke it longer so I can like do the review after once I got a taste of it. It's not the first time I'm smoking it. It probably will be the last time I'm smoking it. Well, I mean, I do have some left over, but yeah. So uh, they're actually supposed to be using real grapes. I think they're using dehydrated grapes because it's really tiny, more like rais raisins. It's tiny like raisins. Um, you get your flavoring and glycerin, so I doubt it's it's because of the fruit that it smells, that it tastes grapes. It's more of a look, though that's the way I see it. I doubt, unless they're like peeled or anything like that for the juices to be like mixed and everything. But who the plays rap music so loud, man? Those young people. Um, <laughs> anyway, um, so yeah. I don't know if it's actual grape that makes the flavor this bold. But there's no nicotine. And you can mix this with any other type of... Jesus Christ, it makes a lot of smoke though. Not like just purging it. There, there was like a lot of smoke. Um, so yeah, real thing to know about hookah fruits, uh, they used to have a Canadian website, well, a Canadian Instagram account, and they actually shut it down because of our laws. So, too bad it had to go out the way it did. Really? Jesus Christ. It's pretty good clouds, pretty good flavor. Um, the only issue is it loses the flavor a lot faster than what they say. Um, they say that you could smoke up to one hour with just like one teaspoon of their product. Uh, I highly doubt it because um, that thing would taste burnt over time. So, And I think uh, the fact that they're using real fruits, the not the flavors, but the product itself kind of has an expiring date um, where the actual fruit can rot. So I don't know about that. Like, I don't know how they did their thing. Um, if they have any type of um, uh, preservatives that they're using to keep the fruit fresh. But I kind of like the flavor. Like, I, I like the product. I don't smoke it all the time. Um, I had uh, guava, which I will not review because it's tasteless. Uh, I smoke it. I smoked it before, and it, you only get that throat flavor of, of, of guava when you eat guava. So it wasn't a very exper like good experience. But grape, on the other hand, or lime, lime kicks ass. Like it's really um, bitter lime. It's it's the actual lime. So. You get like the skin and everything. Um, anyway, but this grape is a good product. If you have it in your country, uh, try it out. It's worth it. But for Canada, like, there's a lot more choices that we can have. Um, so I guess that's pretty much it. And uh, I'll see you soon. If you enjoy those videos, feel free to subscribe. Follow me on Instagram. Everything will be in the description. Uh, don't forget I have promo codes for Bubbly Shisha, for um, Heaven Leaf, and for Flow Tobacco. 
it's also all in the description. Uh, and uh, thank you thank to you. Shisha Nova for actually give, sending me uh, his leftovers of, of that product. That was really cool of him. So you guys take care and I'll see you Wednesday for a different video. Take care.